What's going on, Lead Gen Beast and my fellow Go High Level Entrepreneurs? Matty Ice here from Leads for Locals. Holy crap, do I have an awesome Go High Level training video for you guys today. Make sure you stick to the end on this one. Go High Level just launched a brand new feature for uh, its webhooks, basically inbound webhooks. This is unbelievable, guys, uh, as if Go High Level hasn't changed the game enough. Uh, and what I want to do is show you how I'm using this right now. I'm going to be coming out with a lot more videos on some really awesome automations that you can create inside of Go High Level using this feature. But I want to show you something really cool that I've actually added to my SaaS product. And you don't necessarily have to run a SaaS agency to utilize something like this. But uh, th there's some really cool stuff that we could do with this brand new feature, guys. So make sure you stick to the end. If you find the video helpful, please hit the like button. It does help. Uh, make sure you subscribe. Come out with this stuff all the time. Uh, and if you don't have Go High Level and you want to support the, uh, the content and the channel, I'd really appreciate it if you go through my affiliate link. It's in the description. Two-week free trial, all that good stuff. All right. So basically, the idea of this is to start replacing Zapier a little bit. Now, this is a premium feature where uh, it does cost a little bit, kind of like LC phone and email, where they charge you for you know email credits and SMS credits. So right now, I think it's a penny per action or execution, which is way cheaper than Zapier. Right now, I pay about 30 bucks a month for 750 actions or executions, whatever, inside of Zapier. Uh, for the same amount, uh, it's like seven, yeah, 750. Uh, that would basically cost me $7.50 inside of Go High Level versus $30. You do the math that can save a lot of money over the long run so yeah uh really really cool feature now you do need to enable it because it is a premium feature and i i think you can maybe do it on your agency dashboard but i just did it inside of my sub account and it looks like it did it for all of my sub accounts so you go to automation click on create workflow uh we'll start uh I, well no, here i'm gonna i'm gonna pull up the workflow that i've been using to test all this stuff and uh, what I'm going to be showing you now is is some, just something really cool that I've added to my SaaS product just to make it just provide more and more value to my clients, giving them uh, more and more access to different tools and resources uh, for marketing to grow their business. I don't know why this is coming uh, not coming up. One second, guys. Okay. Not really sure why that took forever. Anyways, uh, webhook test. All right. So... There's two ways to use this. You can actually use this as a workflow trigger. Uh, basically, it's an inbound webhook, which is just incredible. And then there's actually some pretty cool actions you can use uh, as well. So I'll start with the trigger here. And right here, where it says inbound webhook. Like I said, uh, when you, I think when you first click this, like there's just an enable button that you need to click on. And also, I think you get, uh, you, yeah, you get 100, like each sub account gets 100 free executions to like test things out and, and stuff like that. So that's pretty cool. Anyways, once you get that enabled, you have your inbound webhook right here. You could take this webhook and it depends on what software you're using. The example I'm going to show you is a tool called WeConnect. Um, if you're a SaaS agency or if you're a business owner where your ideal prospect, like you would benefit from LinkedIn prospecting, WeConnect is absolutely the best tool in my opinion. It, it beats everything else. Um, I've done tons of videos on WeConnect. I'll drop a link down below on my latest one on how it works. But uh, th this is just the example that I want to give you guys. Again, this would apply to whatever software that you're using that has an API integration feature, you should be able to use this. So if I go into WeConnect right here, uh, so basically what this is allowing me to do uh, in this specific example is I can now import new LinkedIn connections and get all different types of notifications. I'll show you that in a second, but I could basically import data from LinkedIn and put it directly into my Go High Level account, or in this case, uh, my, my client's account. So when they're doing their LinkedIn prospecting, if someone has uh, an email or phone number or whatever, and my client wants to bring that into Go High Level or the SaaS product, uh, it's going to do that automatically with this. So bring in their name, and email address. And now we can create long-term email sequences in addition to the follow-up messages on LinkedIn. Really, really cool stuff, guys. So uh, that's that's for this specific example. So basically what we would do is uh, on, on, on WeConnect or whatever software you're using, you go to the webhooks or API integrations. In this case, WeConnect has webhooks, all right? And we basically create a new webhook and here's all the different things that you can, uh, like all the different, data points or like different triggers you can use with uh, WeConnect to, to trigger inside of Go High Level. Uh, the main one for me is just when a, a contact is connected. 
Now there is a certain way to set this up. You wouldn't uh, initially select it, but that's not the point of this video. I'm just showing you the incredible power of this new Go High Level feature. So we're gonna paste that webhook URL that I copied from Go High Level. You would give it a name, HL test two. All right, we select, you know, what, what exactly are we trying to bring over? Like what, what's the trigger here? In this case, when a new contact or a contact is connected, on my client's LinkedIn profile, it's going to bring that data. It's, it's basically going to trigger this automation, right? Uh, we click save. Uh, we'll click edit here. And then uh, you can send samples because you, um, you actually do need to send a sample in order for this to work. I'm actually going to bring you into my SaaS product automation and show you what I'm doing here. One second. All right, here we go. And also, guys, if you um, if you are running a SaaS agency or you want to, uh, make sure you check out my SaaS agency university. It's like my blueprint for this kind of stuff, like how to build a really good SaaS product, how to get clients, all that stuff. So make sure you check that out. Anyways, uh, so we click. Uh, basically, uh, we send us. You got to send some type of sample, uh, like right here where it says mapping reference. You have to have this in order to be able to save the trigger. So all you're going to do is send a sample. Um, it's usually uh, it usually comes through immediately. Uh, you might have to play around with it a little bit, but this is basically what it's going to look like right here. All right. We save that trigger and then it's going to ask you what information do you want to bring into go high level? And that's what this is. This automatically pops up right here. And then you just, you just map the fields. Uh, so whatever data you're, you're capturing from the other piece of software, uh, that data you're sending into go high level. That's basically what you're doing right here. Okay. Now, I don't know if we can do custom. Oh, you can do custom fields. It's, uh, no, no surprise there. In this particular case, though, we're just bringing name, email, and then maybe the company name. That's really all we would need for this type of thing. And then we can, I mean, let your let your imagination soar with this, guys, because uh, now you, you have all the, with, with this new data that you're bringing in from this other piece of software, you have all the power of the Go High Level Workflow Builder. So we can add tags. In this case, I'm adding uh, them to a long-term email sequence for my clients. So they're following up on LinkedIn using WeConnect because it sends automatic follow-up messages, which is really cool. But now we can connect with them via email as well. So maybe they're not active on LinkedIn as much, but you know, people do check their emails uh, maybe a little bit more frequently. So, but there, there's so many different things you could do here. And yeah, so that's the uh, that's the workflow uh, trigger, the inbound webhook. I, I mean, there's just this is incredible. I'm going to be using this for uh, the because I'm doing a lot of postcard direct mail marketing. I just dropped a video on that. Uh, I'll have an entire I'll, I'll put maybe a playlist down below, but uh, that one has an API integration as well that I'm going to be playing around with this kind of stuff. Oh, man, I just I can't wait to 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 see what we what we're able to build here. But real quick, the actions. Uh, so you have three. Uh, premium actions here. You got Google Sheets, Slack, and then a custom webhook. I haven't messed around with this too much. I believe this is like sending data. Out. So like if I wanted to do the reverse and send data to WeConnect or maybe this postcard direct mail company, uh, like that, that software, I'm pretty sure that's what this would do right here. But uh, the other things, Google Sheets for organizing leads and you know, maybe uh, tracking, creating like specific reports. And, you know, obviously you can do create different formulas and stuff inside of the Google Sheet. So being able to send data directly into the Google Sheet, updating Slack, man, uh, it's really cool stuff. I imagine that there's going to be a lot more premium actions in the near future, but just this stuff alone, man, it's such a game changer. I'm so excited about it. So anyways, that is how I'm using the inbound webhook right now. I will post more videos as I create different automations and share that with you guys. Uh, make sure you check out SAS Agency University and all that good stuff. And uh, drop some feedback. Let me know uh, what you think about this and how you're using it. I would, I would love to hear how you guys are utilizing this so far. This is an incredible feature from Go High Level. So hope you guys are crushing it. I'll talk to you in the next one. Matty Ice is out.